This is the next instrument that we use in ophthalmic surgery for any ophthalmic surgery when we need to separate the two eyelids. This is called a universal eye speculum. How does it work? You see this limb here and you see this limb here. This is the portion which is inserted under the respective eyelids. This portion goes under the upper eyelid and this portion goes under the lower eyelid. Once we have inserted these under the respective eyelids, then we use this screw handle and once we turn it, we open up. That's why this is also referred to as the adjustable eye speculum. This is a universal eye speculum insofar that this can be used in either eye. We can use it on one eye like this or we can turn it and we can use it in the other eye. We can see there's a small angulation here. This angulation is the one which goes over the orbital margin. And the portion that we see here on my right hand, this is the adjustable section, the one which is used to adjust the width of separation of the speculum. So therefore, this is an adjustable eye speculum. However, this has got one drawback. If you notice, once we have separated the two eyelids here, this portion is unguarded. This means that the eyelashes can peep into the operating field once we are doing the surgery. Now, there's another interesting aspect to this eye speculum. Normally, whenever we have any screw handle, it is a universal rule that when you turn the screw in a clockwise direction, you close the instrument. But in this case, turning the screw in the clockwise direction opens up the eye speculum and turning the screw in the anti-clockwise direction closes the eye speculum. So this is the universal eye speculum which is used to separate the two eyelids during ophthalmic surgery. And before we close, I need to point out one more thing. What is the difference between the word speculum and retractor? The word speculum refers to separating two normal anatomical structures in surgery, like for example, the two eyelids, which are normal structures. A retractor, on the other hand, which is also used in various types of surgeries, are used to separate the tissues which have been dissected by the surgeon, the tissue planes created by the surgeon. So that is a retractor, for example, a cat's paw retractor. That is just by the way. So stay tuned for the next ophthalmic surgery instrument.